Day one in Key Cocker and Kaylin and I are already about to head to adventure number one, which is snorkeling. So I'm so excited. Beautiful, beautiful day to go out into the water. Kaylin is afraid of the water. Deathly afraid. Like Deathly afraid of the water, but lucky enough, she said she's gonna come and enjoy sitting on the boat. <laughs> I smell I weed. Smell. <laughs> <laughs> All right, how we go. We made it to Mario's Taurus just in time. Got our flippy fins and our snorkel mask. Kayla and I made it to the boat. This is my boat, guys. Bootylicious Bellini. Oh, Bootylicious yeah. Bellini's allowed. This is the only people allowed on the boat. We are so ready. This is a good boat. I like it because there's shade and then there's not shade. So when we want to tan, we can tan. When we want to get out the sun, we can get out the sun. Once we get done, we'll be so thirsty. We'll just drink everything and have a great lunch and have watermelon juice, coconut water, orange juice, anything we want because we'll deserve it after a long day of being adventurous. Even though Kayla's not gonna get in the water. I may, I might. I it might, might, no, actually, I, I have a feeling that it's gonna be like, like it's not gonna be in the middle of like a no. deep ocean where it's yeah. like dark. Like usually they go, they take you guys, well, not you guys, <laughs> usually they take snorkelers to where it's like bright blue water and it's kind of shallow in the middle of the ocean and you can see like the coral reef and sometimes it's enough to like if you stand you might step on it so you have to kind of like keep yourself up but it's not deep it's not like super super deep about to take a picture in these hammocks in the water it's like in the middle of the water you know but it's shallow enough to stand so this is nice I could just imagine like laying in here and relaxing catching some sun listening to the ocean um, we're still on our tour right now but since it's just Kaylin and I we kind of got to do our own thing <laughs> it feels really good it feels really good in here. Proper way to hold a sardine between your tongue and uh -huh. your index finger. Okay. Like Keep that. all your fingers together. Uh, before they bite it off, right? <laughs> yeah, but Thanks. No problem, right? If uh -huh. you lose a finger, uh -huh. don't worry about it. You'll have nine more. Okay. Right? That's good to know. <laughs> you got it, you got it. Clamp? Yeah. Easy, easy. Just keep your fingers together like that. <laughs> Oh my god, look at that one. <laughs> How'd you enjoy the boat ride? It was great. Yeah, it was so much fun. So we took a break and came to the spot called Coco King. And it's like a little boat ride to the other part of Key Cocker because there's a split where it split from Hurricane Haiti, um, which was like this huge hurricane that happened in Belize. We just ordered some pina coladas and on Tuesdays it's happy hour, lucky us. And look at this, I'm gonna show you guys. So this is pretty much like the best beach in Key Cocker. It's a little bit windy, um, but we're just literally just enjoying our, our afternoon, living our best lives, <laughs> living our best lives <laughs> enjoying retirement age 25 and how old are you? Younger than 25. <laughs> <laughs> That's gonna conclude my video for Belize Day 2. I am currently pooped out from today. It was such a fun day today and being in the sun, being in the water is very tiring and dinner was really, really good. I think I'm gonna call it a day and edit my vlog from yesterday. So I hope you guys enjoyed. There is three days left in Belize, so hopefully we can plan some fun stuff for the remaining days that I'll be here until I head back to California. But thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, and I'll see you in the next one.